Hercules has just come out in Marvel Snap. Is he going to make move decks playable? Probably not. So there's been quite a lot of confusion about how Hercules works because of the way he's worded. I originally thought that every card that moves to the Hercules location for the first time that turn would get moved. So he could move multiple cards per turn. And that is what one of the devs said on Twitter. But when I tried him out today, it turns out he only moves the very first card that was moved to his location every turn. He's actually a lot worse than I thought he would be because I wanted to play him with Heimdall on last turn and move all the cards that move to his location to the other locations. But that's not how it works. So he only moves one card and it's the one that moves to him first. Sad noises. He is of course at home with move decks in combination with most move cards, especially Human Torch, Vulture, Craven, and Miles Morales. And that is the deck we're trying him in first. I also added the updated Kingpin to this deck because it helps us a lot in mirror matches and if we paired with Juggernaut. Come over here. What do we think that is? It's probably a psych. Oh no, it's not Cyclops. Alrighty, we can do this. It's probably that. Uh, I could also do like Kingpin, but I don't know if that's good enough. Should I play it anyway? Because next turn I probably want to play like Hercules, right? Okay, let's just do this. Because I don't know if I want to. Uh, maybe I want to move Craven Vulture and Human Torch next turn. Okay, we have initiative. Oh, this kind of sucks a bit. What if we do... Hum hum? Uh, I need to do something like with Jug, I think. And we have initiative as well, so... I'm hoping they don't go for right side. And then we do this and this and hope that whatever they play in the middle moves left. Hmm, it's a bit risky. Now let's just do this. I don't know if this is enough. Okay. We need to make sure that whatever... It, it goes left. Please go left. Oh no. It did not go left. Oh wait! We're still fine. Let's go. Hey Vivon! I thought if it was Hulk, we would have lost, I think. Mm, I'm not sure. My vulture is pretty big. It's what? Um, 17? Mm -hmm. Blob is a okay. Blob is a great card. Well, this game, at least I can get Hercules out early. But they can get Blob out early too. Ooh, that's big. Hercules on the right, and hope nothing moves middle, uh, left, nothing moves left. Is it blob time already? Are we getting blobbed? Ooh, this might be okay, I can get two Cravens. <laughs> Guarantee getting buffed by Hercules at least. Magneto. Okay, so if we do this, 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 we're getting blobbed again. But there's really no point, um, no point fighting because we have nothing we can do to compete with their power. So might as well just play out, to be honest. Too much power. Unfortunately, it's gonna draw the Craven, right? Not sure. Let's have a look. I could also jug them. But let's jug last turn. I hope it moves the Human Torch. Okay, it only does just move one card per turn. That's kind of sucky, honestly. Okay, what's the last card we played? <coughs> you think they play on the right? Or in the middle? Probably on the right. 
I think on the right. Okay. Oh, do we win then? Boogies. We won. They didn't have Taskmaster. Hey! We won the game! Let's go! Okay, the Hercules seems to be a much worse card than I thought it would be. Much worse. He only moves one card, whereas I thought he's gonna move multiple cards. Wave. Is it Blob already? Please no. It's too early for Blob. I can't. It's too early. Where do I want to put the Hercules? In the middle? Not sure. Okay, so we do Craven and Cloak. Next turn I can move the Human Torch there, and then we'll get moved away. And then we'll play Heimdall. They're gonna blob us. We're gonna get blobbed hard. Okay, so what if we do this? Alright, this will get moved somewhere else, and then we do this. This way we should be winning a bunch of locations, but it's hard. Oh? Wait, we might be okay. No, we're not okay. Wait, we might be okay. My human torch is absolutely humongous. Oh no, it didn't move. The human torch didn't move. We almost beat them on the left with Craven. <laughs> Let's go. I also wanted to try Hercules with Phoenix Force. It's a bit tricky because they're both four energy cards. So I don't know if it's actually worth it to play Hercules in this deck because you won't really have a lot of turns left to get value out of him. But it might still be okay. If we manage to pull off the multiple man combination, we can have a board full of multiple man without having to play much on turn 6 at all. This deck is quite linear and does require a lot of setup. So if you want to have a less greedy deck with another win con, you can remove Taskmaster and either Iron Fist or Ghost Spider for Shuri and Nimrod. I can even play two human torches actually. Uh, no, I can play two Phoenix Forces. Oh, they're also playing Destroy. What? What is that? Um, is this gonna get destroyed? Actually, this is gonna get destroyed, isn't it? Because they have... Um, they probably have... Shoot. Killmonger. Crap. And they have another one too. Wait, this is a 1-9. Costs one? Alright, they're not they didn't play the Miss Mar the Killmonger. That's fine. I have another one. Alright, we have another one. How do we do this? They're gonna play Killmonger again. Probably death. Death and Killmonger, because it destroyed enough cards, right? How do we beat that? Move it to the right. It's gonna get killed. So there's no point moving it, really. We do this. Uh, if I play it actually on the left, it might get eaten. That would be bad. Alright, let's see. Okay, Killmonger. Please go left as well. Thank you. Jeff, is that enough? Okay. 
It is enough. Hey, we did it! Okay, we went middle. Oh, look at my human torch. It's absolutely humongous. 136! <laughs> oh. Victory. That was very juicy. Nice kill, Monger, though. Okay, our hand is really good. Hand is amazing. If only I had Forge. Forge into Multiple Man into Carnage. Oh, it's subterranean. Dang. I hope I can actually draw my Phoenix Force. Oh my days. Eee. This helps them because of Killmonger. They just Carnage on the in the middle then? Oh my god, we actually got our thing. Okay. Just don't Killmonger me now because that would be bad. I want to bring back my Phoenix Force. I want to bring... Oh god, not Killmonger. Okay, that's good. I want to bring back my multiple man, not thingy. If they killmonger me now, I'll be very upset. But you know, they might have not drawn killmonger, so please not killmonger. Oh, thank you. Yes, we're doing it! We're doing it! We are doing it, chat. Hmm. It's only an 8 though. It's probably okay. Uh, let's do this first. Then we do this. And then move it here. Are we snapping? And snap. I hope they stay. They did stay. That's not very big. Hmm, okay. It didn't work like I thought it would. I can move all of them. <laughs> so we move one here, one here, one here, and then I don't need to do anything, right? It's just big enough, I think, to win without playing anything. Okay. Alright. I hope this is enough. Now I'm not sure. Rock? Rock? Killmonger. We did it! We won! It could have been more satisfying, I think, but this was good enough, honestly. Overall, Hercules is a fun card, but I don't think you need to invest your spotlight keys or tokens into him. At 4 energy, you won't have a lot of time to make use of him, with only 2, maybe 3 turns left of the game. His stat line is okay, but he feels a bit lackluster compared to the other strong 4 energy cards in the game, such as Loki, Werewolf by Night, or Ms. Marvel, or Iron Lad. The other cards in this week's spotlight caches are Howard, the duck and werewolf by night however the duck is a card you should not be opening your spotlight caches for him just wait for him to drop to series 3 eventually and get him for free werewolf by night is still a good card but he feels a lot weaker to me now because of black knight and thanos blob dominating the meta plus with hercules coming out this week and the new kingpin change you really don't want to be playing werewolf by night i hope you found this video helpful make sure to drop me a like or a comment or both and subscribe to my channel and i'll see you next time bye